Hello guys, this is MXMTXS and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm here with another player review, this time on Team of the Year, George Best. Keep out as an SBC, of course, he is about 2.1 million coins. So he is quite expensive, but I mean, his base card was fucking insane. So I'm expecting this card to be even more insane. But before I do head into the video, boys, do make sure to like and subscribe. And let's get straight into the video. He has a five star, full star. No problems with that at all. High medium work rates. We take a look at his attributes, 93 pace, 91 shooting, 86 passing, 94 dribbling and 73 physical. The pace, of course, is fantastic there's no problems with that at all shooting looks very good as well 88 attack positioning it's not too low as well finishing is great of course even the passing stats don't look horrible so you can actually make a few passes his dribbling is fantastic boys there, there's literally not a single thing that's bad with the dribbling it looks insane his stamina as well is quite high as well at 91 and the strength of course is quite low at 70 but except for that it looks like a beautiful card if we take a look at his playstyles he has the technical plus flare first touch plus trickster and the quick step playstyles this is the team that we'll be playing him in and yes as you can clearly see there is a few team of the years in the squad because something might have happened is what i'm gonna say boys but there's gonna be a video on that coming out soon but enough of that let's get into the first match george best great positioning and that's already should have been a goal all right george best keep going oh the pace is so good on this card oh for fuck's sake he has yashin it's over for me all right george best that's nice Oh my lord, he's so agile. Good passing to Armstrong, who is through. Can we score? Yes, we can. And that's an assist for George Best. George Best is through. He's going to take the shot. What the fuck, man? All right, George Best, he's through once again. We're going to take the shot. Bro, Yashin, fuck off. George Best, please. Oh my god. Okay, we'll take the foul. Oh, it was actually a penalty. I didn't actually realize. Jesus Christ, Bright has 98 penalties, but we'll take it with George Best, of course. We're going to try and go. Okay, we do, we do. Okay, I didn't even know where I was going, but we scored a goal. It is a penalty, which is a bit sad, but we move. And we have a rage quit, boys. Um, George Best should have definitely scored a few more goals. Uh, I think I need to work on my finishing 100% because I keep finesse shotting because I am a bit stupid like that. But nonetheless, his dribbling was pretty good. I was I didn't really have major problems with it. I kept messing up a few dribbles because I am shit at this game. But nonetheless, not a bad card. Good passing, decent shooting. Just couldn't get the finish off, sadly. But yeah, on to the next match. George Best, that's our beauty of a pass to Armstrong, who is going to score that. Of course he's going to score that. That's Armstrong for you boys. Into George Best. Oh. Oh, surely. Hey, fuck you, George Best, you shite prick. What the fuck? Bruv, 2.1 mil to miss that type of fucking shot. No, no, no. Do sour. Fuck George Best after that bullshit. Do Bruno for what I care, bruv. George Best, good run, surely. What the fuck is this card? George Best, that's beautiful. Okay, we might actually have a chance to score, but no. George Best, please do something good. Please score that. Thank you. I thought he's been a fraud, man, because he missed two fucking easy goals. George Best. George Best, surely. Oh my god, I can't score with this card, boy. It's not for me. George Best, please score. Please, there you go. All right, boys, we have another rage quit, and that's another win as well, to be honest. And George Best walks away with the player of the match with two goals and one assist. Missed two fucking easy shots, though. Now, that was really concerning for a card that's 2.1 million. You do not expect him to even miss or get it off target. So the fact that he did is very, very concerning to me. I played him up front, as you can clearly see as well. Uh, and yeah, eventually got himself the goals. Doesn't make too many runs though, which is what I've noticed as well, which is also really concerning. But nonetheless, on to the final match. George Best, good run, surely. Let's go, George Best. Beautiful finish. Good run as well. George Best. Van Dyke is no problem for him. He's going to go all the way and not score. I tried to get under his legs. All right, boys, we do actually have a rage quit. And I mean, what I did notice was that George Best was actually making a lot more runs. Uh, got himself a goal as well when I played him on the left side. So, I mean, maybe on the wings, he might perform better because he does have those second positions as well. Yeah, I mean, he's not bad. 2.1 million. Mm, we'll see. Heading on to the final stats. 
Alright boys, 3 games, 4 goals, 2 assists, 2.1 million, no. Personally for me, no. Go get his base card, it would probably do the same fucking thing for you for way, way, way cheaper. Unless you have a lot of fucking fodder that you don't mind shoving into an SBC, then yes, go for George Best. He, you might actually like him. But the upgrade is not noticeable that much to be honest, I'm not gonna lie boys. I know I'm bad and all, but like his base card was miles and miles and miles clear. I mean, if I go and take a look at his base card, as you clearly see three games, three goals, six assists. This card was so much better for me than his team of the year, which is crazy. So out of 10, I would probably give this card like a solid maybe six because he is good. 2.1 million takes it down a notch. His base card is about 500k and you're paying 1.5 million more for a card that's not that good compared to his base, which is crazy i should have probably bought his base as well i kind of regret doing this instead of sawa because maybe sawa would have been better than him i'm not gonna lie but maybe i'll get used to him and maybe he'll stop performing better but he wasn't crazy for me personally in my first three games with him so yeah six out of ten in my opinion it's a bit disappointing i wanted it to be way better because i am a united fan of course george best everybody knows george best i wanted him to be good but he's just not that good compared to his base man so yeah boys if you did enjoy this video do make sure to like and subscribe let me know in the comments down below if you agree or disagree and let me know your experiences with team of the year george best because for me he wasn't all that but yes boys it's been mx and txs goodbye